any electronic components from circuit board is this uh, valuable or west so let's find out this video this is our accumulated a tiny component from electronics uh, actually I have accumulated here maybe 5 kilogram and this is our last uh, west from our depopulation but this is not uh, totally west because some of these components are containing gold silver and other precious metal yeah. Some valuable components here uh, are resonant oscillator, tantalum capacitor, solid electrolytic capacitor, demodulator IC, AEPROM IC, regulator IC, and ceramic capacitor. Uh, this is the actual image of resonant oscillator that containing gold plated cover here uh, steel at the top and uh, bottom are ceramic uh, let's see a closer look okay see very tiny this is very tiny and there are different uh, formation there is a rectangular square and a flat surface here but this is valuable this is uh, containing nice gold at the bottom at the back of this plate here and uh, this is also very nice full gold, full gold plated as you can see here yeah the second uh, this is a tantalum capacitor which is containing gold wire bonding here there are many types of permission also square rectangular and uh, this is a large piece here let's see a closer look with our camera here yeah here here it is the two legs and the connector here is a gold wire bonding I see it personally in my sample but I don't take a video oh. so don't waste this one because this is valuable containing gold wire and uh, silver very nice And number three, this is a aluminum solid electrolytic capacitor which is containing also gold wire band, banding, gold wire banding. At the bottom, there are there is two legs. Some of them are containing tantalum and other, or maybe silver. But I found this one, the connector in between the gap at the underneath, it is carbon. It's a gold wire bonding. Very nice. Let's see a uh, closer. This one. Yeah. That is valuable uh, tiny component from electronics also. Containing gold wire. Okay, number four. This is the tiny guy. <laughs> Here, this is a demodulator IC. Which is containing gold wire band bonding inside so let's zoom in to see clearly yeah that is exactly look like this is the demodulator IC mostly found in cell phone circuit board this is valuable containing gold wire inside and silver
but the silver here is just a small amount very nice component number five this is Iiprun IC this very tiny component mostly found also in internet router mobile phones uh, circuit boards so let's zoom in see clearly it's look like a crab but it's not a crab that is a a from IC containing also tiny gold wire banding inside very nice buddy next the regulator IC this regulator IC containing gold wire also so this is belong to our sample and uh, the past video so let's zoom in to see clearly okay then, uh, that is exactly look like uh, this is mostly found in computer circuit board internet router That is valuable tiny component on electronic scrap. So next this tiny one. This is MLCC containing silver. Mostly found in internet router, computer board, and also uh, telecom board. It's like that. very tiny I add more MLCC here to see clearly uh, let's zoom in alright sometimes containing silver and palladium ok here we go the procedure of recovering precious metal in this material so stay watching because we are almost done and stay focused and if you reach this part here, congratulations and thank you very much for watching. So let's begin with the oscillator. Okay, we have two different best process here for resonant oscillator. First, you can directly dissolve into aqua regia or you can also dissolve base metal first. It depends on what's your comfortable but uh, in the end that's a good result okay we have a tantalum capacitor uh, first procedure here is to burn this one and crush to expose the gold wire and base metal and you can reduce the ash material by panning because uh, this material is light, very light, and easy to, to wash out. Or uh, you can this add to the bigger after crushing. You add to the bigger and add distilled water, 50-50 with and concentrated HNO3 or nitric acid to recover silver. Then the remaining material is proceed to aqua regia. Be sure to remove sil silver first to get a better result because if you directly dissolve into aqua regia here's you have encountered a trouble because silver uh, precipitate and combine to the ash material and you never recover recover it so sayang no sayang. silver is uh, also valuable material so that's it Next, this aluminum solid electrolytic capacitor. The process here is to burn this one and crush this material, reduce the carbon or maybe ceramic, sometimes ceramic. Uh, if ceramic, uh, no need to pan. If carbon, you need to reduce the carbon to recover exact gold and the material. 
Then this also Aquaridia. Then you can select precipitant. Uh, there are many precipitant. Okay, we have the next the modular IC. The gold wire banding here is too tiny and it's very hard to see directly into your naked eye without any equipments like uh, magnifying glass. The tiny gold wire banding is difficult to control or in uh, panning because very tiny. All you need to do here is to burn this one, crush the material, then dissolve base metal because sometimes the base metal containing also silver and separate the solution then dissolve into aqua regia by the 3 to 1 ratio mixture so that the reaction is quicker uh, the gold isn't absorbed the carbon separate the carbon immediately to prevent the absorption of gold from the carbon so next okay we have ea from ic the crab ic as you can see but the gold here is very tiny and the procedure here is uh, sensitive because if you pan this one with uh, after after burning after crushing uh, the gold wire is uh, hard to control maybe you lost all the gold so all you need to do after burning crushing then dissolve this metal then separate the solution then aquaridia make it a uh, 3 to 1 ratio with aquaridia to react faster also because containing carbon and carbon you know the gold absorbed to the carbon and you lost everything or you lost your gold next we have regulator IC we zoom in yeah uh, this is also containing gold wire bonding uh, the process here is remove the base metal first because this material containing large amount of copper and copper consuming too much acid so after burning crushing the material then proceed for strainer to capture this copper here then you can proceed for aquaridia directly mixed into 3 to 1 ratio to react quicker because sometimes there is uh, there is carbon here then maybe the gold will absorb the carbon so so the last one here is MLCC capacitor ceramic we zoom in to see clearly uh, yeah. other people uh, say that this is also containing palladium but uh, sometimes silver the process here is very simple and faster you can add to this material into the beaker then add distilled water then CO3 or nitric acid after the reaction has uh, completed then remove the solution and filter then precipitate with hydrochloric acid or maybe copper copper bar it's very simple Maybe this is the last video of the year 2024 and to those who subscribe us like comment and share our videos one who sent me a gift thank you very much and highly appreciated you hope you are always good health wealth and merry christmas and a fruitful new year to everyone so see you next year stay connected stay friend i love you all thank you very much